It is a project in controversy, and now if President Trump's proposed budget for 2018 is passed, Albuquerque Rapid Transit, or ART, may lose funding. Action 7 News reporter Justin Matthews joins us live with how the community is reacting. Well, Doug, there's a lot of mixed emotions. Mayor Richard Berry says he's confident we'll still get money for this, but others say there's no way, and it's time for all of this to stop. The construction? It makes me not want to live here. A Central Avenue business owner who says she's losing clients because of this and says she doesn't feel any better about the future. Now that President Trump's 2018 budget proposal doesn't include funding for projects like this. How can you work without having the money to do it? But Mayor Richard Berry says he still expects the money to come in. He says the funding for art would come from the 2017 budget cycle, not the newly proposed 2018 budget cycle. I have a lot of confidence that the United States Congress, the men and women that go there to serve, aren't going to allow any community, whether it's Albuquerque or Phoenix or Houston or Los Angeles, to have a half a project uh, unfinished. I spoke with KYT political analyst Brian Sanderoff, who says the current administration is unpredictable, so Mayor Barry and his team will have to lobby very hard to ensure they get the funds for this year's budget cycle. That doesn't mean a thing to me because they have been asking it for a long time and they haven't gotten it. But Stella Padilla is not convinced. She's running to become mayor of Albuquerque and organize this protest. It doesn't seem like they're going to get it. And Mayor Richard Berry has been lobbying for the money since August 2015 and expects the $69 million in federal funds by July or between July and this fall. We're live near Central and University tonight. Justin Matthews, KOAT, Action 7 News.